Assalamu alaikum and hello everyone. Welcome back to the subject mathematics year 4 DLP. The topic that we are going to learn today is round of numbers. In your, in your textbook, you can refer to page 15, 16, and 17. Before we start our lesson, let's revise on place value. Given example, 56,237. Why you must know place value? Because when you want to run off numbers, you must able to identify the place value of the digit. Okay, we start to revise place value from digit 7. The place value of digit 7 is ones. Digit 3 is tens. Digit 2 is hundreds. Digit 6 is thousands. And digit 5 is ten thousands. In year 4, you only learn numbers up to 5 digit numbers, which is the highest value is ten thousands. Now, let's go to example number one in your textbook. Overall participation of 12,295 Malaysian citizens from various government and private agencies, school children. The question is, round off 12,295 to the nearest, nearest thousand. I will show you how to round off numbers by using number line. Alright, first of all, you need to copy this number back. 5,295 And the question asks you to round off to the nearest thousand. So you find thousand, ones, tens, hundred, thousand. Then you need to fill in the starting point and the ending point of the number line. Okay, how you want to fill in this starting and ending point? So, based on the thousand here, you ignore the other digit on the right, and then the starting point should be 12,000 and ending with 13,000. That's how you decide the starting point and ending point of the number line based on the thousand. So I fill in here twelve thousand and the other side thirteen thousand. And what happened to the graduation? between the starting point and ending point because of starting and ending point is counted by thousand so the graduation between must be counted by hundred so this graduation should be twelve thousand one hundred twelve thousand two hundred twelve thousand three hundred 12,400 until 12,900. So, right now, we will try to locate the position of 12,295 in the number line. So, the position should be here. As you can see, between the distance 12,000 and 13,000, this number is nearer to the 12,000. So, when you round off 12,295 to the nearest thousand, the answer will be 12,000. 
So, we can fill in this question by putting the answer 12,295 is between 12,000 and 13,000. 12,295 is nearer to 12,000. Twelve thousand two hundred and ninety five becomes twelve thousand when rounded off to the nearest thousand. That's how we answer the question by using number line. The second question round off thirty eight thousand seven hundred and four to the nearest ten thousand. So, we circle 10,000, write again the number 38,704, and this time, I want to teach you to do round of numbers by using plus zero and plus one method. First of all, you must know the member of plus zero group. Plus zero group contain zero, one, two, three, and four. Why? Plus one group starting from five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, we go back to the question. Round off to the nearest ten thousand. So you find ten thousand in this number. You know that. 3 is 10,000 and then you draw a straight line like this and then put plus on the top of 3 after that you look the digit on the right of 10,000 which is 8 you find the position of 8 in which group plus zero or plus one you know that it is in plus one group so plus over three here is plus one after that you cancel all digit on the right of the line here and replace with zero so you write the number again 3 plus 1 equal 4 followed by 0, 0, 0, 0 which is 40,000. This means when you run off 38,704 to the nearest 10,000, you will get 40,000. Okay, next question, question 3. Round off 19,500 milliliter to the nearest thousand milliliter okay so i write the number again 19,500 milliliter and find thousand digit 9 is thousand so we need to know what is the range for the number line here so according to the thousand we cancel all the digit on the right of thousand and then the range of number line should be starting from 19,000 until 20,000. So, you write again in the number line, 19,000 and 20,000. So, the graduation between 19,000 and 20,000 should be counted in 100. 19,100. 19,200, 19,300, 19,400, and 19,500, okay? 19,500 actually is in the middle of 19,000 and 20,000. When you round off the digit involving 5, so it will belong to the larger value 
which is 20,000. That's why when you round off 19,500 to the nearest thousand, you will get answer 20,000. It is similar when you using plus zero and plus one method. You want to run off to the nearest thousand and then you put the straight line and the digit next to thousand is phi. You know that phi is belong to plus one group. So nine here you need to plus one and cancel all digit on the right of the line and replace with zero and then you write again the number 19 plus 1 equal 20 followed by 000, zero, zero which is 20,000 both method number line and plus 0 and plus 1 method you will get the same answer which is 20,000 and for the last question that I want to show you in this tutorial is question 4 Round of 63,988 to the nearest 10,000 ringgit. 10,000 ringgit. So, I write again the number. 63,988. And then, digit 6 is 10,000. And then, we draw a straight line here. The digit next to 10,000 is 3. So, we refer to the group here. We know that 3 is belong to plus 0 group here. 3. So, plus 0 group. You need to put plus 0 on the top of 10,000. Plus 0. Okay, and then you cancel all digit on the right of the pole or straight line here and replace with zero. Six plus zero equal six and followed by four zero and then put RM so you get answer 60,000 ringgit. I hope this lesson will help you to understand topic round of numbers. Good luck. See you soon. Bye-bye.